Welcome back to the channel. Today, we got something a little bit special that I know a lot of you have been waiting for, and especially me. So we got all the cars here, Nick Z and Payday, but the only thing that we are missing now is my Z, the Pro Charge 350Z that I've been building over the last three or four years. It's in Louisiana, and I'm in Georgia. So Payday is unfortunately getting moved out, and in the garage, we're gonna have the Z here, but first, we have to go get it and drive it back eight and a half hours with no power steering, no AC, and no radio. Man, it's just probably not gonna be a good time. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and get into it. Let's go get the Z. Oh, yeah. Finally made it back to Ruston. Now, after eight hours, me and Sarah are really tired of sitting in the car, so we're going to get coffee. Actually, last time I was in Ruston, I was moving out of Ruston, and I tried to bring Zoe with us on a U-Haul trailer, but unfortunately, it just was too low, and I was forced to leave the car behind. That's actually why you guys haven't seen it in the last few months. The car has just been left in storage back in Louisiana, but this weekend, we're here to retrieve it. This is the last of my vehicles I need to get in Georgia, and then from this point, forward we just got to make one more trip back to Louisiana with a U-Haul to get everything out of our shop and then we're gonna put in storage and then eventually in the future we'll either end up getting another shop or we'll keep it in storage or I'll get a bigger house something there's always room to upgrade and uh, oh my god there are so many people at Starbucks mm -hmm. you're buying me coffee yeah Wow thanks she's so sweet to me mine. Coffee. Mine. Coffee. You can have a sip of my coffee. Cool. Ooh, okay. Mmm. It's good. Money is on it. All right. We're here. Time to go inside and see what all kind of stuff. Sarah's so excited. I'm so excited. Um, she has been literally squealing for like the last 20 minutes as we get closer because she is so she's just so excited to ride in the car. Just. I miss that car. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, I miss it a lot too. Wow, this feels old. I haven't been here in forever. We do have a lot of stuff to move out of here though. The car is ready just to pull straight out. All I gotta do is just get it started. Get it started. Yep, the battery is definitely dead. Pick it up. Come on. And now we're in the trunk. Mine. Oh, so your thing is still there. Yeah. Even your battery's in the back. The battery's just in the back. Huh. All right, hopefully she still sounds good. Oh, it's still dead? What? It needs to charge for a little bit longer. A few minutes later. Nope. It didn't really get that much better. The car is honestly too dead to start right now. We got a charger hooked up to it now. Tomorrow, by the time we get back to the car, it should be charged. So, tomorrow's gonna be our test drive. And until then, I don't have anything because it's raining. So we're just gonna see you guys then. All right, welcome back, guys, to the next day of trying to get the Z running. Let's do it. Hey, it's really not as cold in here as I thought it would be. It's been like 40 degrees today, where yesterday it was like 70. So we're gonna go ahead and turn the heat on and get it warmed up in here. In the meantime, we're also gonna get Zoe running. I gotta air up the tires because it is so much colder outside. It definitely is gonna need more air. They're probably at like 20 PSI right now. Get all the stuff that we're gonna bring with us. We got more parts, power steering up here, more suspension in the front. We got some more parts that we're gonna install on the car once we actually get it to Georgia. And once we uh, once we get up there, it's probably gonna end up going on jack stands immediately. And we're gonna be putting on a whole bunch of stuff over the next few weekends. So now we just gotta get the car started. And after this, we're gonna take it for its first test drive and make sure that everything is still working before we go on this eight hour drive tomorrow. Here we go. Go start. Can't do this to me. Oh. I told you. Now I'm upset. Why? Why? What would happen? You want to jump start it? Yeah, we'll try to jump start it one more time. Oh my god. This 
is bullshit. Bullshit. Battery should not be this hard to deal with. Get another one. Swap it out. Yep, I guess we'll get another battery. We'll be right back. And now we got the new battery at Advanced. By the way, if you get these yellow top or red top batteries, they come with a three year warranty. Just make sure you keep your receipt. Hopefully this fixes the car and we can actually get it running and get it back home. Okie dokie. Time to get the race car running. Zoe, I don't wanna hear any fucking complaints. It's so dark, I need lights. Why did I not put more lights in this shop? I'm seeing now what I did wrong and what I should do better in my next one. All right, I'm gonna strap this thing down and then we'll be ready for another cold start. Oh, it's like attempt number seven right here, like that. Hopefully she starts. Oh, the fuel pump sounds good, you ready? First cold start in like five months. make some noise new battery is it gonna work second time It's been a sad time without this car. I can't wait to get it to Georgia and just show all my neighbors how much of an idiot I am. So fun fact about this car, since I don't have a dash also, the button to pop the lid for the gas tank is actually now above uh, the tachometer. So, so you, got the, you got the gas button. Press it a couple times. I'm gonna keep it stock. <laughs> Life is funny. Holy shit, I forgot that the wing doesn't have the pins in. I didn't put the pins back in the wing. Oh my God, I am such a... Well, we're going slow on the way back. <laughs> oh my God, dude. I... Look, look at this. <laughs> oh, I hope that stays up on the way home. How's the car sound? Amazing. Cool. I miss this car so much. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, what'd you miss about it? The way it goes. <laughs> oh, oh, you like the. <laughs> yeah. No. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> Oh 
god, that was so much fun. Good for the soul. That was so great. All right, lit. Car's reliable. Good job, Zoe. Now that you're not being a bitch anymore about a dead battery, let's go home. Ooh, that's cold. This is about to be the most miserable thing. Eight hours of no AC or heat. God, dude. All right, goodbye, Pit. It was good having you. I'll be back for all this shit in here later. Goodbye, giant Daniel Poster. Bye, giant Daniel Poster. You will be missed. What a great tapestry. Let's ride. It's fucking cold, bro. Unreasonably cold. Let's get these windows up. All right, now there's not as much wind, so it's at least a little, a little more bearable. I got two layers of pants on. I got some khakis on underneath, and then a layer of PJs over that to help hold in the heat. Let's do this to Georgia. <laughs> We're on the road. see what kind of gas mileage we're getting. My guess is gonna be like maybe 20 miles per gallon. I'd be lucky if I think if I'm getting 20 miles per gallon with this supercharger. 90 miles. How much gas did we put in? 5.6. Yo, do 90 divided by 5.6 real quick on your phone. 16 miles per gallon on the interstate. It used to get 26 before I had the supercharger. Yeah. Wow. Okay, we are back in the car. Got some coffee. Went pee pee, and now we're good to drive another 200 miles before I gotta get gas again. Back on the road again. I can't wait to burn so much gas on the road again. You know, this has been a really rough ride. I'm cold, I'm exhausted, my back hurts, I'm sweating, even though it's freezing in here. Hello. It's cold. It is cold. Let's see what the gas mileage is on the last trip. We adjusted the speed a little bit and started going five mile an hour slower on the interstate, so hopefully that saves us a little bit of money. Oh. 11.6 gallons. So 190 miles. Okay, divide that by 11.6. 16.55. 16 and a half miles per gallon. Well, we went slower trying to adjust the miles per gallon and we're getting the exact same. We can go a little faster on the it way home. It went up by half. It went up by half a mile per gallon? Yeah. The Z is officially the most expensive car for me to drive. This really is the most shittiest of the shit boxes, but it's also the fastest of all my cars too, which is really strange. We got food, we got drink. 
Now we only got a little bit of sunlight left. You can see the sun's gonna be going down probably in the next two or three hours, thanks to daylight savings time, whoever's idea that was, and then we'll be home. But it's probably gonna be dark then, so you guys aren't gonna see much. That being said, let's finish the last three hours to get home in this really, really obnoxious car. Time to go move some cars around. Dude, it is so fing cold outside. All right, well. We do no, have correct. so many cars. Daniel has so many cars. You have one, I have one. Daniel, Daniel has four. four. <laughs> Whoa. I got burgers on the grill. Oh, oh hell cool. yeah. I'm finna roll it and go set up by a fire. Shit. Uh, you can stay in the house. Oh, okay. You'll hear it. Oh, yeah. We're about to hear it. Yeah, you'll hear it. 